Hey everybody, this is Chris with Overclockers Club. What's going on with the 50 series? So today is February the 4th and earlier today there were some reports and this is on Tom's hardware and there are lots of uh, headlines here that are pretty much saying the same thing. Reports are that there are issues with the cards not running at full PCIe 5.0 speeds, uh, problems with the card not booting up after a driver update, uh, some melted power connectors, uh, and we'll go as far as even having some cards that end up being bricked. And I think the melted power connector thing may have already been debunked, but you know how that stuff is once it gets out in the wild. It's pretty much unstoppable. Now it's not unusual, well, unless you're Tom Jones, but it's not unusual to uh, have some growing pains there and usually the driver updates resolve most of those issues. We usually don't have a regression with driver updates. And you can see here my 5090 has been running just fine, no issues, and I've been hammering on it. We're running at full uh, PCIe 5.0 speeds. Uh, again, no issues, no problems with the 5090. Same goes for the 5080. Uh, I've had no problems with it. Obviously it's not running at the moment. And I'm running the latest BIOS on a Z790 MSI motherboard and a Z890 ACE MSI motherboard. And this is the driver that I've been running on both of these graphics cards on both of these test systems. And uh, knock on wood, I have not had any problems. Now there are reports that some people who have had a black screen where the card won't boot up uh, they go into the BIOS and they change their uh, PCIe slot from Gen 5 to Gen 4 and they're able to get them to boot up, but I can't confirm that. So hopefully they get this all figured out. Check back and I'll try to keep you updated. This is Chris with Overclockers Club. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe.